Good evening. Much of Scotland is under a red weather warning tonight for snow. The blizzard conditions have wreaked havoc for drivers on the M80, the country's worst affected road. Some people have been stuck there for eight hours or more. Police are urging people not to abandon their vehicles. Our transport correspondent David Henderson is there. Well, conditions here on the M80 motorway are absolutely atrocious tonight. Sub-zero temperatures, driving snow, not the sort of conditions you'd ever expect a driver to want to stay out in. And yet here we are, hundreds of vehicles lined up and down the northbound carriageway of the M80, stuck fast, going nowhere. You may be able to hear those car engines, the vehicle engines, are, are turning over so at least people are able to stay warm while they wait but many of them have been waiting many hours to get off this motorway. We're told that there's been an accident, a jackknife lorry, a few miles north of here which makes it impossible for the emergency services to clear the road and get these vehicles off but that's what they're endeavouring to do. Southbound, you can probably see there, the carriageway is clear. The reason for that is that the road has been shut off, shut at Perth, no more vehicles are being allowed onto it. And while there's no vehicles here, a little way north of here at Castle Carey Arches, there's been so much snow, again vehicles are stuck there. So lots of drivers remain stuck on the M80 motorway. The emergency services are endeavouring to get them out while they're waiting. Their advice is for motorists not to leave their vehicles, to stay in their vehicles for their own safety, for their own welfare. And in the meantime, what they're calling welfare teams are moving from one vehicle to the next, checking on drivers, making sure people in these cars who are enduring this long wait are, are comfortable and are safe. But as far as the operation is concerned, to clear this road and get these people moving again, there's no time frame in mind. It has taken many hours to reach this point and it's not at all clear how quickly this road can be cleared in the hours ahead. Well, earlier we spoke to Michael Blair who was stuck on the road on his way home to Perthshire. It's, I've had the car on and off, keeping it warm. I've got a couple of Mars bars. <laughs> uh, I'm hoping to keep it too for a wee while before I have to get, get into them. But the, the snow is coming in really heavy showers. It get, for a wee while, when it was daylight, the, uh, the, uh, the the sky cleared and it was it looked quite, you know, sort of optimistic. And the next thing was it just went black and the, it's just you know, heavy, heavy showers of snow. Glasgow Airport is completely closed to incoming and outgoing flights until tomorrow morning, with hundreds of passengers stranded. The Red Cross has been handing out emergency bedding supplies to those whose flights have been cancelled and have no way of leaving the airport. Passengers are being taken from the main terminal building to a space in the nearby Holiday Inn. Heavy snow and sub-zero temperatures brought huge disruption. People are being advised not to travel and hundreds of schools have been closed. Rail and bus services have been curtailed or cancelled. Andrew Black reports. 